Hey there, Aquarius. Welcome to Healing Guys the Rose. This is going to be for your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. And we're going to tap into past, present, and future um, with your person. And if you don't have someone in mind, then it might be someone new coming in for you that we're tapping into their past, present, and their future with you. Possible future. Okay, let's see what's going on for you. What's going on with you? for your past? Let's see. Hmm. Mm. Well, it looks like something new came in and ended something here. So there might have been some passionate new beginning for you, but it ended something else. It put an end to something else. Could have been a relationship that came in and came in like crazy strong and passionate and that you ended it with somebody. But someone um, was trying to make an offer here. And someone wasn't sure if they wanted it. Okay. We do have the Emperor here. Aries energy. It could be doing it, Aries. Or it could have been you just standing your power. Okay, let's see about your person. Yes. Queen of Cups. Ooh. Eight. Oh, okay. Let's see now. They have the Knight of Cups at the bottom of the deck here. So we have a Queen of Cups, which will be Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. doesn't have to be in this person's past. Could have been your energy. Could have been someone else's energy. Someone that's very loving and nurturing. But someone felt stuck. They couldn't see the opportunity here, the Ten of Cups. Someone came in, Knight of Cups. That could be a Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces with an offer here. But maybe this person wasn't seeing any future with this Knight of Cups. Okay, let's start clarifying. Why do we have the Ace of Wands for you in the past? Why is the Ace of Wands for you in the past? Whoops, this is popping. Okay. Two of Swords. Needed to make a decision, but wasn't getting all the facts. Couldn't make a decision right away. Why do we have this Ten of Swords, this ending? It's a very painful ending. Oh, because of the Queen of Cups. Hmm. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. There's an ending with a Queen of Cups. Or they could sing you as a Queen of Cups and there's an ending. Okay, what about this Four of Cups? Okay, so there's competition. So someone didn't want, know whether they should offer their love. And someone was abandoned here with the Five of Pentacles. Because of competition or people interfering um arguments th it, this was not working for some reason and that's why it ended there's either other people involved or um there's too much competition or too much struggle it wasn't an easy relationship for whatever reason so you either you or them didn't know if they wanted to um continue with this okay what about the queen of plus for them why is the queen of plus for them Eight of Cups, walking away. Wow. Someone walked away from the situation. That's exactly what happened. I don't know if, you, if you're the Queen of Cups or if they're the Queen of Cups. But someone, I think it was you that you walked away from the situation. It wasn't fulfilling. Something wasn't going right. And I think you're the one who walked away here. Okay. And what about this Eight of Swords? Whoa. So this person also couldn't make up their mind what to do here. They felt trapped, mentally trapped. I don't know if they didn't know whether to go after you or what was happening. Because they saw you as this Ten of Cups here, maybe. They did or they weren't sure. Didn't know if they... Some of them may have seen it, some of them weren't sure, I guess. And what about the Ten of Cups? Why is that here? Wow. Ten of Cups, yeah. They definitely seen you as their Ten of Cups. But they were trapped in their head. They didn't know what to do here for whatever is going on. There's some kind of conflict or people involved and stuff, and they didn't know how to handle it. But I think they saw you as the Queen of Cups. Okay. It was very sneaky behavior, though. Hiding things. not letting, I don't think this person was honest with you. They wanted to come forward with the, this Knight of Cups, but they, they weren't sure. Okay, let's see what's presently going on here.
Okay, you're taking it easy right now. You're doing well. You're, you're concentrating on yourself. You're probably um, involved in your work or just making money and um, doing your own thing. And um, either you're thinking of offering someone something or someone's thinking of offering you something here with the Page of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Someone might be thinking of offering you something. Oh, yeah. Because then we have the Knight of Pentacles, too. So I think someone is coming in with an offer. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Seeing you that you sort of took a time out. Maybe they said, okay, um, I had to give Aquarius some time to re rest and, you know, heal. So I think they gave you time to heal. But they see you're, you're single, you're doing well. So they might be coming in now. Okay. Now, what is going on on their side? They, again, the two of swords, this person cannot make up their mind what to do. They don't, there's things that they don't know. They they want to know more. Queen of Pentacles, they might see you as the Queen of Pentacles or they're the Queen of Pentacles. Doing well financially, very um, grounded. And the Emperor. I feel like this person sees you more with Queen of Pentacles and they, are, they want to take charge. They want to be empowered. They want happiness here. Aries, Leo. So I think they want to come in, but they're waiting until they're empowered or they're feeling stronger. Okay, why do you have the Four of Swords here? Ooh, there's someone spying on you. Someone's just watching, seeing what's going on with you. They might even have other people watching. You could be starting something new too. After a break, you might have took a break from something, and now you might be learning something new. Okay, what about this Nine of Pentacles? Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? Huh. Someone's going to come in with a love offer. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces doesn't have to be. Maybe even Apology. See, you're doing fine. Coming in. You might have a couple people coming towards you. Ooh. This person here, the Page of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn has a lot of memories of you oh look you're in the emperor mode too you're both in the emperor mode wow so yeah so they're they might be reflecting on the past or you might be reflecting on the past you both might be okay now person's present energy i think you're learning something and there's something you're just doing your own thing and you are thinking about this person from the past too let's see we have here oh the magician this person is trying to come into their power, trying to make something happen here. Not sure how to approach something. So they're trying, I can be using some magic maybe. I don't know why I got that, but it came up. Ooh, they're, they're planning to come in and quick. Cancer energy, charging ahead once they come into power more. Four of Pentacles, they want to hang on to this. They don't want to let go. And I think they've been through a lot. So they've been through the battle here. And I think they don't want to fight anymore. They don't want to be, um, they they want to just be able to have, be at peace, I feel. Okay. Now what's coming in the future for you, Aquarius? Let's see what's coming into the future. Ooh, coming in some money. Um, Long-term commitment. Financial abundance here. Ooh, making you very happy. Leo energy could be dealing with a Leo. And trying to decide whether or not some more time and effort into something. Queen of Wands. This could be you or this could be your person. But someone finds someone very attractive or you are very attractive at this. I think you're very attractive at this time in general. That's what I'm getting. Okay, so now this person over here. What's going on with them? Okay, they're doing well here. They're doing um they're doing well being single and um making money. Okay by themselves. Ooh. Now they have the nine of wands. They've been through a lot, but maybe they're um starting to straighten things out now. Let's see what else we have. Ooh. 
Ooh, yeah, they might want to come in quickly here. We have the Knight of Wands and make an offer. Okay, Page of Pentacles. We have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I think they're coming in quick. They might even come in with a gift or some type of offer, but they might come in really quick. They're like, here we have the Nine of Wands here, and then we have the Nine of Wands here, and I'm thinking, you know, they're not fighting anymore. They're not, they're done. <laughs> okay, let's Let's see, why do we have the Ten of Pentacles for you for the future? Ooh, you're going to get communication from somebody here. Maybe about long-term commitment or about a job or about some kind of financial abundance. So you're going to get some news on that. And um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Could be a letter, phone call, text, email. Okay, what about the sun? Why do we have the sun here? Ooh, wow, yeah, you're coming to your high priestess. Very, in your intuition is going to be so strong now. So really pay attention to what comes in. And we also, this is like known hidden things, and this is hidden things here with the moon, Pisces energy, and balancing things out, Sagittarius. So things are going to be working. This is Pisces energy. I think they're going to be working out. And this is Virgo. Sagittarius. Yeah, it's like there's going to be a lot of emotions that you're going to be experiencing too, it seems like. Okay, let's clarify these cards. Why do we have the Nine of Pentacles here? There's the Nine of Pentacles here. Ooh, Nine of Pentacles. This person is doing very well financially and being on their own. Okay. What, there's got a lot of nines for this person too. Getting completion, King of Swords. It might be um, maybe they're coming into some power here. It feels like, and they want to speak the truth. Now they, they're looking over at you, so I think they want to come in and um, have a, a discussion. Very intelligent. New beginning. They're gonna come in about a new beginning. And Page of Cups, and they're coming in with an offer of love here. Maybe apology, too. Wow. Okay, guys. Let's see now. What signs can we be dealing with? Cancer? Cancer? Sagittarius? Aries? Scorpio and Pisces. Boy, you got all the water signs. You have Sagittarius and Aries. Okay, guys, so this could be your person's sign. It could also be a placement in the chart called be a placement in your chart. It could be other people around you too. So don't get too hung up on the signs because all the signs are really here. There's general reading because it could be anybody's sign. Um, please let me know if this resonates. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I hope to see you again real soon. Thank you so much.